But But all he wants, all he gets. You see, my Tomcat's got this much fuel in it in front of the CG, you know, so you know, it won't affect it. It'll be a little nose heavy, you know, the first few minutes, and then, you know, it'll start bleeding off about five minutes into the flight. The, the CG's coming around and it's performing, you got your thrust ratio back, and Got some vertical. And it is going to take 10 minutes to fill this thing up. That's crazy, man. That's crazy fuel there, man. There's my flashlight. My flashlight, Bill. I need a new one. I had to tape it to swing together. I need a new one. Bill gave me this a couple years ago, and I still got it. See, Bill? That's what you mean to me. Then you ain't gonna go to California. I don't believe it. Everyone, Bill says he's going, but he's really not. I'm on this game. We gotta talk him into going. Come on, Bill. Let's go to California. Got another inch to go. Getting close. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna have to charge my <laughs> it's my fuel jug tonight. I don't know that. By the time I suck this back out of here, that is some serious fuel, man. Oh, go down. Start pumping it into the overflow here pretty quick. Both tanks filled up all the way to the top. So I like to see. Okay, we should start going into the overflow if it's going to burst. Pop! Oh, wouldn't that blow? That would be a mess. And that's why they use Kevlar tanks. <laughs> <laughs> there it goes, it's in the overflow. See the pump laboring? There's some pressure in them tanks now. Boom! I gotta put the large fuel line on my tank. On this, I got a small line. So that's really putting the pressure in it. Gotta keep going.
still dry guys. I tank in the overflow, shoot this thing, ain't gonna need no overflow. <laughs> ain't gonna need no dang overflow. ECU and my fuel line back in it and we're ready to rock. Alright guys, that's all I got from the shop right now. We'll see ya. Same Bob time, same Bob station.